Kieran, maybe we we'll start with you. You you won you won your first cap against these boys here. That's right, 1993. Yeah. That's a little yeah. two years ago. Two years ago, more hair. Um, you uh, and Moro. I mean, well, actually, I have, yeah. I mean, it was. I don't know whether it was there 20 years ago, but um, I have to say I was absolutely shitting myself because I'm sitting in a changing room. My dreams come true. I'm playing for my country. And I look around, and there's absolute legends of the game: Brian Moore, Dean Richards, Rory Underwood, Jerry Guska. I was like, wow. And you were there as well, Will. <laughs> We walked out into the tunnel and we had no chance. They'd just beaten Scotland by 50 points they hadn't lost in a year and a half, a bit like today. And as we line up, the Irish referee turned around to both teams and said, Right, lads, keep it clean, may the best team win. And Jason Lennon was right behind me and said, I fucking hope not. <laughs> I don't know whether you remember, in that match, there was a certain flanker called Jamie Joseph who stood on my ankle. Shame on him. And I'm lying there, and it's about 90 seconds into the game. And I'm lying, looking up, and I'm thinking, my first cap, 90 seconds, that's all I've played. And I'm thinking, I'm out of this. The only thing... Moro, do you know what? I, didn't, I don't know if you Moro was laughing at that point. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't like it. <laughs> but I was thinking, I've got to come up with my first cap, I can't believe it. And the only thing that kept me going was the fact that I didn't want Matt Dawson to get on the fucking pitch. <laughs> You also, well, there's you, Matt, and Austin, which was the big sort of, uh, big competition, wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, not so much Austin, because he couldn't pass, so he went to the wing. Um, <laughs> no, but, it, it, do you know what, one of my favourite moments, favourite moments, it'll be interested to see what the All Blacks think about the psychology of the game, because the All Blacks, they've got this, you know, myth about they are, you know, unbeatable. And they were, when, they have been for almost 20 years. But one of my favourite moments was quite longer than that. that was trying, Clive Woodward was, was trying to instill belief in our team. We're up at Old Trafford, and he walks into the team room, and he puts the team up, our whole team up, okay? And then he puts the All Blacks right next to them. And he stands in the middle of the two teams, and he goes, I would not swap one of these England players for one of those New Zealand players. And across from him, looking at it, it's just the marsh, I think, oh, I'm not sure. <laughs> And then there's Johnny Wilkinson, yeah, he's better, he's better. And then there's a bit of a giggle at the back of the room. And he looks across and he goes, you know, why, why are you giggling? One of the boys goes, I'm not being funny, but do you not think we should swap Austin for Jonah Langley? 